Hey everyone, thanks for stopping by and welcome to my channel. My name is Jenny and I hope you're having a fantastic day. I have an amazing Dollar Tree haul to share with you. Everything I picked up is brand new. All of my items at my Dollar Tree are only $1.25. There's nothing else more expensive than that. They also still have some food items for a dollar. And of course, their greeting cards are either a dollar or two for a dollar. If you never know what to look for that's new at the Dollar Tree, then I suggest you always watch the Come With Me to the Dollar Tree videos that I post throughout the week because those are the videos that I will be showing you what is new and what to look out for. I give you some measurements here and there on how big and small these items are. I also love to share my DIY ideas on how to use these products in a different way. Also, if you like to follow me on Instagram or TikTok, I'll link that down below. So with all that said, let me dive in and let me show you on these fantastic items I was able to find. I'm going to start off with these. There's five different ones. I have four right here. I didn't really care for the other one, but these are the Natural Pumpkin Picks. Yeah. Again, there's five different ones. The only one I did not purchase is the one that had like the moss all over it. Now these, you can cut the stick off if you choose to, and you can just use the pumpkins around your house on a shelf, um, which I'll probably do most likely, most likely because I don't think I'm gonna stick these into anything. But look how amazing these are. I've never, ever, found anything like this at the Dollar Tree before. So those I know will go quick. And these, I haven't tested them out yet. There's four different ones. And these are called Harvest Mini Loaf. They are five inches. These are microwave safe and dish washer and oven. Look at this one. This one says fall is my favorite color. You have the pumpkins and the leaves. They have it on both sides. Say so you don't make anything like a loaf. Okay, go ahead and put some fake rock in there. Put some fake that moss or whatever kind of filler in there. You could take some flowers. You can take some of those little pumpkins from the Dollar Tree. You could even take some of these and stick them in there and do a cute little flower arrangement and put it on a little shelf, on a cabinet or whatever. You could put maybe uh, uh, Q-tips or ponytail holders or stuff like that and place this in your bathroom. So I picked up this one and the fresh picked apples with the truck and the gather which of course has the beautiful blue pumpkins that I am addicted to this year. So these are really nice and they are heavy, like heavy. All right, these are amazing. Great find for $1.25. My husband has been using it and he loves them so far. This is the New Zealand Clean Beauty Kiwi Botanicals. This is the Nourishing Honey Melt Facial Cleanser. And this one is the Brightening Honey Melt Facial Cleanser. So there's two. So the Honey Melt Facial Cleanser. Okay, this is the Nourishing and this is the Brightening. There we go. Look at that. There's all the information on it. And he's been using it for hmm, about a week, I do believe. So while well, this is the container, which is really cute, that you can always clean out when you're done. Ooh, first time I've looked at it. Ooh, really? Put that on your face? So it's kind of like slimy, but that really smells good. It smells like a smell like I don't know what you smell like but you smell good kiwi bird I always thought kiwis are pretty cool so 
yeah. And these make great gifts. Once again, I know it's only August, but I tell you what, Christmas is going to sneak up on you. And I have a lot of birthdays in December. I have my mom December 16th, my mother-in-law December 16th, my daughter Ava December 22nd, no 21st, no 22nd, December 22nd. I have Grace December 30th and well then my other daughter Samantha, she's January 12th. And if my dad was still here, it was January 8th. So yeah, I like to start buying stuff close to about six months before Christmas and birthdays because my wallet would be like crispy dry by then if I waited to the last minute to do everything. These are new by Crafter Square. These are canvas bags. They have it in black and your normal regular taupe color. They do have the little strap which is a rope so if you are going on maybe a hike or a small walk or an amusement park the beach you could put your stuff in here if you choose to you can always decorate it if you have a Cricut and you know how to use it unlike me um, you can do different things on there. You can customize this. You could do like even for a gift. You can customize it with their name or their family's name, a pet's name, um, or a saying. You could fill it with maybe some makeup or some gift cards or something like that. I think that would be really cute. So that's pretty long. And the zipper is like really nice quality too. So again, Crafter Square, and these were over with the craft items. Now, probably not every Dollar Tree is going to have these products in the exact same spot as mine. So that's why I like to tell you, you know, I did find these with the Crafter Square stuff, but I would also look over by the tote bags and by the socks. Yes, the socks. So, yeah. Cool. They have some new keychains. These are really cute DIY projects for your little ones or yourself. I believe they had five different ones. I just went ahead and picked up this little bear. I'm gonna customize it and I'm gonna try to write a name right here on the foot. So thought that was cute. And they also have new ones of these. They had, I think, yeah, they had four new ones. Was it four? Yeah, four new of these wooden, wooden crate things. So this one has a squirrel cut out they also had a leaf, an acorn, and a pumpkin. These are really cute, could customize as well. I've done DIYs in the past using these to make uh, tear trays and you can fill it with different things. Endless possibilities with those. So I thought those were cute for the fall. They had their little cement uh, statues again. So I went ahead and picked up this adorable squirrel Again, you can always paint these if you want to change it up a little. They had, I think, four different animals, but the squirrel, I don't think I bought it. Oh, yeah, I did. I picked up the hedgehog only because my dog, my French bulldog, French bulldog. Yeah, French bulldog. Frenchie. Whatever. It's been a long day, people. Um, she loves all of her hedgehog toys. So I'm like, where's your hedgehog? Where's your hedgehog? We, we talk so weird to our animals, I know. So that's why I had to get a hedgehog, just because of Josie. And of course, I had to get a squirrel, because 99.99% .99 of dogs love to chase these things. But do they really catch them? Mine hasn't. Although Ruby did catch a chipmunk about 10 years ago. Horrified. Uh, they have some new uh, harvest pails. I think these are a oh, plant or whatever you want to call it. But this one is always be thankful. I really like this one, again, because of the blue pumpkin. Now, this would be something cute if you bought these and you wanted to keep it on the stem. Go ahead and put those in there. You can buy some of the fall floral and do a cute, really uh, cute uh, centerpiece. Or you can put this up on a shelf if you choose to. But these are really nice. It's called a round tin pot. Close enough. And they have so many new canvas pictures. Now, with a lot of my canvas, if I don't like to keep it how it comes, um, I showed you that not too long ago. I cut out a picture of a bird on their canvas, and I put it on one of their round... Uh, you know what? Let me show you right here. Right here. Plain and simple. 
I cut it out, put it on the piece of wood, and there you go, and just decorated the bottom. So that is why I like to buy different canvas from the Dollar Tree and do other things with it. And these are by special moments, but look how cute. This is like boho decor major, like right up my alley. So I did pick up that one and this one and this black and taupe. And I thought this one was really pretty. I love scenery pictures. And this one that pretty much goes with anything. And it does come with the little thingy maneuver here to hang on the wall. It does have a wood frame. You can rip the staples out and you can use the frame with something else and then cut out the picture, do whatever, Mod Podge it on a vase or whatever. So that's why I like those. Okay, so when I first came across this at my Dollar Tree, I'm like, is that a bottle of wine? I didn't know they sold alcohol here. And then I got looking at it and I opened the top and I'm like, what is that? It's so weird. So of course, since it was weird and I was confused, I had to buy it to bring it home to figure out what the thing was. It's a curly, uh, curling, or curly, curling iron. Cool box, which you can probably use for a gift. It's like butterfly gift or whatever those things are called. So this is the torture device that you will... Uh, receive here in your weird big box and if you like to play tic-tac-toe you know buy a few of these and play tic-tac-toe with the x's but you'll have to make your own o's there's all the directions for you which is very confusing i already tried it on my son why not my daughter i don't know but i did on my son and it actually kind of worked but i am not going to use it on mine because it's going to probably tear my hair out but you have two choices you can have the four prong or they have it with the three prong now the difference of style I have not the slightest idea but I like how it comes with the little holder thing but again all you do is put it well you know I just can only live once I guess so you just put it on your hair like here and you go <gasps> I don't know I don't trust it See how it moved my hair? Oh, don't rip it. Did it do anything? No, probably just puts knots in your hair and then you go to brush it and half your hair will fall out. So yeah, I guess that would be um, nice. I did look, 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 I did look this up and I guess this is going for like 40 some dollars on, I don't know if it's eBay or Amazon, I can't remember, but really, if you have bought this, and you've tried it, or if you know someone that has tried it, let me know if it works. I would love to know. Cool box though, but yeah, I thought it was fine. I don't drink, so it doesn't really matter to me, but you know, it's just something weird. So they have some new lanterns, and these are pretty big this year. They are plastic. They have a black one with the bats, and then they have this orange one with the pumpkins and spider webs. You have to provide the AAA batteries. It takes two of them. You can see it has a huge tea light in there, kind of blinking. So this is what it looks like in the dark. Again, this is an LED lantern with a flickering effect. I don't think it flickers that much, but you know, that's just me. If you don't like the color, you can always spray paint it. I would try to take out the light if you're able to, if you do spray paint it. Otherwise, you're going to paint over your, I don't see if the top, looks like the top comes off. Oh, it does. Look, the top comes off. So if you didn't want to use the top, you don't have to. You know, that would even be something cute. Maybe do some kind of floral arrangement in there of some sort and have these sticking out and kind of have the light coming through. I don't know. I use this for something else as well. But look how big that tea light is down there. But again, you have to provide the two AAA batteries, which of course you can buy there at the Dollar Tree, which I think you get a four pack. Could be wrong, but I think it's a four pack for $1.25. They have these this year. They're pretty solid as well. They're in the shape of a leaf and they have initials on them. So you can spell out 
your last name or a message or by all the initials for your family. I just went ahead and got um, MJ um, for Matt and Jenny. It is plain on that side, so if you want to do something else, you can. So these are really, and they're heavy, solid, like solid. So did grab a couple of those. I thought this was cool. They've been carrying a couple of different ones of these. This is an Ink 32 Color Me Postcards. Holiday, thinking of you, congratulations, thank you, friendship, celebrate just because, and happy birthday. Again, you get 32 of them. There is the back. And this retails for $9.95. So they are postcards, as you can see, and you color them. You don't have to use them as postcards if you don't want to. These look like about the size of maybe a five by seven. So if you wanted to buy a couple of frames, you could and frame these if you don't want to use them as a postcard. But I think the colors, oh, look at that Christmas one. Look how cute that is. And of course, these were with the books. The other book I picked up is this one is Greeting from Strange Planet Postcards. Look how cool that is. And it retails for $14.99 in the U.S. and $18.50 in Canada. It includes a um, number of postcards. Includes blah, blah, blah. The number is 26. So you get 26 postcards. There's the back, what it looks like. And then they have different pictures. So how cute are those? So if you still like to send out mail, it'd be something cute to do. So again, with the books. And I did pick up this movie, like I stated before, the Dollar Tree always carries a lot of DVDs, Blu-rays, and books. So I went ahead and picked up this Animals Are People too. It's over three hours with two DVDs of animals. Look how cute it is. Gotta love animals. So picked up that one on that trip. Picked up this fall sign. It says pumpkin patch caramel apples. And it's got the green truck, which I thought was cool. This is a 10.2 by 12 inch sign. You can always paint over it if you want to. The back is plain. So I did grab that. Uh, they have a lot of new Halloween signs that they've never had before. I picked this up for my oldest daughter. Now, this is something that you can hang up all year round if you choose to. Right here it has, I just really like the purple. I know nothing about this astrology stuff or whatever they do with this kind of stuff. But look how pretty the colors are. I will link the video down below if you wanted to see all the other ones they had. I mean, they had a slew amount of brand new items like this. So I really like the color, which I thought was cool. Here's some glitter bones. They do have the giant ones. You get a two pack or you can buy this little pack of 36 by Crafter Square. You could spell out some words using these bones. You can do some fun DIYs. Um, you can always uh, spray paint these as well. Or I accidentally dropped uh, fingernail polish on something like this years ago. I'm like, I think you can probably use fingernail polish. I don't know if you would, you know, want to encourage kids to use fingernail polish to color glitter bones, but I don't know. I also picked up these color your own ornaments. You get an eight pack and it does come with the twine. I thought the ghosts were really cute. And these are in my crafter square. And yeah, hang on a little haunted tree. They had some more little pumpkins. You get a pack of five. These are called wool pumpkins. They had it in the green, the orange, and the white. I'm not a huge fan of the stems on these little pumpkins this year. It almost feels like a flannel kind of, but you can always cut these as well. So grab those. Uh, they have these cupcake picks. You get 20 per pack. I bought the orange pumpkins and the brown acorns. Now I'm just going to rip the stuff off of the toothpick because I don't need the toothpick. You can always use it for something else. 
But I would use, well, I guess, but I would probably suggest using a pair of pliers so you cut it off nice and clean. So there you go. You have yourself a teeny tiny pumpkin. You could put a little message on there. You could put people's initials, uh, initials. I'm telling you, I can't talk today. Um, initials, you can spell out fall or love or, you know, whatever. And I know they have these in like Halloween as well, um, but I thought the pumpkins were really, really cute. So you can do some cute DIYs with those. Also, I picked up these baking cups. They are two inch, you get 75 per pack. Another item that you can do some really cute DIYs with, you can cut the circle out, you can cut around the entire decoration, or you can just lay them flat. You can Mod Podge them on a picture frame for scrapbooking, a background and something or whatever. Or you can take a bunch of these and Mod Podge them on a big vase. Something different to do with these, but I thought these colors were cute. And a few other items. Uh, this actually works really good. This kills 99.99% of germs. It's a multi-purpose cleaner. Um, Otoban eliminates odors and disinfectant. Fabric and air freshener. It's a 27 ounce bottle. Yeah, it smells not, it doesn't smell that bad. I mean, we have a couple of bottles of this now, so. Uh, a few other items. They have this glitter tea light candle and you get 120 total hours. Do we really sit there in time to see how long that tea light really works? I went in and picked up the ghost. There's the candle. I'll open it right here to show you what it looks like in the dark. And the ghost is on both sides. I do believe they had three or four different ones to choose from, but I thought the ghost was cute. The last two items I picked up um, we have the Texturizing Hair Perfume. It's a coconut sea salt. It's a four ounce bottle. Enjoy effortless beachy waves with a single spritz using this blend of tropical island scent. Well, let's take a sniff. And it probably has paper that I will have a heck of a time trying to get off. So let's see what this smells like. had, I think four different ones, I do believe. So. gonna leave my hair wet I don't know but that really smells good that one is the coconut sea salt mm. texturizing this one is glow hair perfume glow so what glow in the dark boost your hair radiance with a single spritz using this blend of balancing scent did I, I don't know if it didn't show you the bottle of that I don't know if I did but well let's go ahead and we got the paper on here too, and I don't even see where the little thing. We're just gonna do it this way then. Wait, I can't really get the full effect on that because I can't spray it. I don't think I can really smell anything, but I can't anything yet. I don't have scissors. Oh, wait, did I get it? No, I'm getting it. Oh, got it. Doesn't really have a scent really. I like the other one. That one smells really good. Coconut sea salt. It smells like a fudge. Wow, you guys. That smells good. This is the one. That is the one that smells so good. So, well, that's everything that I bought at my Dollar Tree. So I hope I was able to show you something that maybe you can go find at one of your local stores. I wanted to share this with you really quick. They did have four different ones. I bought this from, I think it was on Target's website or Amazon. This is the Tiny TV Classic Clips from Season 4 of Friends. It, it's a real working TV, top screen, or top scenes of tiny series. Look at this. Look at the box. Love the box. So let me show you on what it looks like. You get the background right here, Monica's apartment. 
and you get the little TV right there and a working remote. So on the back, you have all the buttons. I'm going to hit one of them. <laughs> so you can just flip through it and watch different scenes and everything. They also had... <laughs> and they had Jaws, uh, Star Trek, and... I uh, can't remember the other one, but I do believe this was at Target, I do believe, online. I think it was 20 bucks, maybe, or QVC had it as well, I'm not 100% sure, but I know a lot of you are Friends fans just like me, so I just thought that was really cute. Now, the ones like for Jaws and um, Star Trek, the TVs are like the retro TVs that we had back in the early 70s and 80s, but I just thought this was really cute, and I wanted to share it with you, so that my subby friends is everything I'm able to share with you in this video. So if you enjoyed, I would love for you to hit that thumbs up. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, I would really love to have you. As always, I want to say thank you for always taking the time out of your day to stop and watch my videos. I hope you all have a wonderful, beautiful, safe day, and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys. Keep smiling. <sighs> Oh.